the kitchen something ooey and gooey that constitutes the perfect Halloween snack. No tricks here, just treats. Studio 5 food producer Alex Danes is joining me with the recipe for, here it is, slime caramel popcorn. That's green. Bright green. It's green. <laughs> it's not just green, it's bright green. I don't know if with the studio <laughs> lights and through the lens if it's coming through, but we have ourselves some slime green popcorn, people. But this is better than like your kid's messy slime at home okay. because it's edible. So this is gonna be not only sticky, but delicious, which makes it worth it, right? Totally. <laughs> makes the mess worth it. And it's something that, I mean, you can make caramel popcorn, I realize it's kind of a seasonal treat, but you can do that any old time. But Absolutely. green popcorn just screams Halloween, so a last minute treat for moms and grandmas to try. What do you have going on the stove? Yeah, you probably have everything for this recipe in your pantry, which is perfect for Halloween time. We can just throw this together. Excellent. So I started, this recipe is so simple. Four ingredients, one cup of butter, that's melted here in our saucepan. Melted and simmering. One cup of brown sugar. All right. This so, is gonna make our caramel factor of this recipe. So far it's passing the pantry test. Right, you got, you got those two ingredients. Yes. So you just wanna mix those two together so that the uh, sugar isn't, you know, really grainy in here. Right. And then all that's left is 16 ounces of mini marshmallows. Oh boy. Want to dump that in sure. there? Sure. I'll go a little bit at a time, otherwise I know what will happen. I know. We'll, we'll throw we've, that in we've there. We've done this long enough. That <laughs> we've we've cooked in the kitchen together. Just like I've swept many a marshmallows. <laughs> we can we can explode <laughs> this, but that's it. So that keeps the mess contained, you know, to your saucepan and as the marshmallows melt, mm -hmm. you're going to mix that all together, get it nice and coated, and right. it's going to create the caramel sauce. So if you were just making regular old caramel popcorn, mm -hmm. This is where you would stop. You could, right? Mic drop. <laughs> Mic drop. The game could end now yes. and no one would complain about it. Exactly. But it's Halloween. But it's Halloween. Yes. So we're going to take it to the next level. Normally, you know, we'd let that get all the way melted down, but for the sake of TV, we'll jump right ahead. So sure. this will melt all together. It'll be like a, just a delicious marshmallowy caramel. Uh -huh. And then we're going to reach for our food coloring. Okay. And I like to, for the coloring, I like to reach for one that says it's gonna be bright. So I like to look for a neon green. <laughs> this one's actually an electric green. So I like to look for something that's gonna be bright and vibrant because yeah. we want that in our slime. Well, you say slime popcorn. I'm a child of the 80s. This is before your time, but there used to be a slime show on Nickelodeon. What was it called? Oh, oh there was. Where they no. dunk you in slime? Yes. Are you pretending to no, know what no, I'm talking about? No, no, I know exactly what you're talking about. She's young and cute. Yeah, no, so like, when you say slime popcorn, it's gotta be green. Yes, it has, it has to be a slimy green. Yeah. So I'm just gonna put a couple of drops in here. Okay. Let's see, there we go. And the more the better. And see how that's just melt, melting down there. What was that show called? I am trying to think. There, well, they, they did like the Kids Choice Awards, and those always had slime. slime. I know, but it, it, it had originated from this Oh, but it's show. so, see I'm, see, I'm Kids Choice Awards. And I, I think I'm that's the, how far I go back. There was a kid, oh, someone's yelling at the camera right now as a screen at home. I, I know, they're I know like, tell are. us, tell us. What is it? Double Dare! Double, Double dare. dare! It was called Double Dare. Okay, I missed it. Mark Summers, right, was the host. Um, had a crush on him. Oh, okay. I don't okay. know, how did we get down this road? It's because fine. Because of slime. Because of slime. Because of slime. And they would slime. And look at it. It's getting nice and slimy and green. So that's how you make the caramel. I do have a tip for the popcorn with this recipe. One, you can use an air pop popper, which works great. But I like to use mushroom popcorn, which is a little bigger kernel, oh, okay. which is going to hold up the caramel a little bit better. It's not going to break down as much. And so to pop the mushroom popcorn, I have found that the very best method is this silicone silly bowl from Amazon, $15. You put a fourth of a cup of the kernels right in the bottom. Okay. Loosely drop the lid down. <gasps> throw this in your microwave. You pop that in the microwave. This whole thing. Yep. And Press the lid the just rises with the corn. Yep. It just lifts up with it. It's not like sealed. Press the popcorn button and then you're gonna have perfectly cooked that popcorn. That sounds like a $15 add to cart that I will not regret. Absolutely, we'll get you a link, don't even worry. Okay, good. And then this is my tip for getting the kernels out because there's nothing worse than biting, you know, right. kernels in your popcorn. Right. Just take a wire cookie rack uh -huh. and then tip it over. I do it over the trash can or the sink, but tip it over and shake it. Okay, you're genius. And see how those kernels are just falling right through. You are a genius. That way, none of us are going to break our teeth and I just give it until nothing falls out anymore. Keep it going, keep it going. And there we have it. So it's about three-fourths cup of uncooked popcorn kernels. Okay. Yep. I like to use this silicone bowl because it sticks a little less. We're mm -hmm. trying to contain the mess. This is 
just the perfect size. I mean, <laughs> just what you want. You just dump it all in there, yeah. but you've got your green slime, you've got your caramel popcorn here. Am I seeing mix-ins? So we can do mix-ins. Normally you wouldn't, you know, with caramel popcorn. But with this slime, if you wanted to bring it to life, you could do some eyeballs, which would be really fun. Yes. You could also reach for the sprinkle mix, yes. which would just, you know, bring it to life. As of course the original over there is having her moment with just the, the fluorescent so green. How you've displayed it in this huge, I'm sure dollar store, Walmart cauldron. Yeah, just throw a cauldron. You've got to have one lying around somewhere. That's right? so cute. That's, That's what I'll say. so cute. Alex, thank you so much. Yeah, you're Slime welcome. Slime popcorn, are you ready to pour? Yeah. You want to pour? Here we go. Here it comes. Let's do it. Oh yeah. I mean, is that appetizing? Yes. Sure. <laughs> We're gonna tell, when you taste it, it is. And just be gentle as you fold it over with the popcorn. But All right. Easy Alex, peasy. Thank you so much. Coming in clutch with our last minute Halloween recipe for caramel slime popcorn. You can find this recipe on our website, studio5.ksl.com. Just click the recipe tab, and Alex promised a link to that ever cool little popcorn popper. You'll find that there too at the Studio 5 website.